While everyone is busy watching Stranger Things, Marvel movies and series and every other thing, a gem of a show like this is going under the radar. This mini series is all about this segment of Mr. Bean's episode number 5, The Trouble with Mr. Bean, where he heads to the park to have a peaceful picnic by himself but then pestered by wasps. In this series, it's the B. In this slapstick miniseries, Ron Atkinson played the role of a man who tried many jobs but failed because somehow he managed to find trouble in odd things. Like he lost a job as a state agent because he thought paper shredding machine was trying to kill him. His ex-wife is fed up with him but his daughter is still hopeful that he will come good one day. Fortunately for him, he finds a job of house sitter. And unfortunately for the house owner, he lands his first assignment in their house. The house is stacked with valuable items and his only job is to look after the dog and the house for a few days. The house is ultra modern with motion sensors at all places. The job which should have been easy and looked easy as his wife said, sitting all day doing nothing turned into a colossal work because he could not ignore the presence of a bee and he tried every trick up his sleeve to get rid of it. Watch this eccentric, self-centered, narcissistic person stooping new level of stupidity and create anarchy of comedy. This could have been a 9 minutes movie but it was designed to be a series where one or two incidents will happen at every episode. In these times where all the movies and series on OTT or in the media are trying to be clever, sci-fi, socially or politically relevant, this series gave a big middle finger to all that and tried to have a good time. <laughs> You're not going to learn anything from this series. Rowan Atkinson in recent years tried his band of comedy Johnny English Reborn and Johnny English Strike Again. They did well in box office but were not good enough. They might have got few giggles but were not up to his standard. The stories, the setup and every other character did not go hand in hand with his physical comedy. But this series gave him a center stage and gave him an opportunity to work alone like he did in Mr. Bean. Man vs. B is more like a cartoon than a live action series. There are many things which will happen in this series which might not happen in normal circumstances. So you have to watch this series without judging. When I was watching this series, it felt like I was watching Mr. Bean and that's not a bad thing because who doesn't like Mr. Bean? <laughs> if you don't like Mr. Bean, go to a good heart surgeon and ask him to replace yours with a beating heart because your one stone cold. Rowan Atkinson is the last of the true comedians who are left in this cancel culture, too sensitive, lack of sense of humor world of social media. This 9 episode mini series can be finished in one sitting. This series is not a laughing riot but a constant smile generator. In order to watch this series you don't need brains, you need two eyes or one eye or whatever you have. Enjoy Mr. Bean's work, love, live and prosper. And boost my algorithm by liking and sharing this video. Sharing is caring.